How's it going, YouTube? I'm Stefan. I'm Rebecca. And together we are SNR Eats. And today we're actually going to be drinking. We're going to be drinking some Japanese teas. <laughs> There's no alcohol involved. <laughs> <laughs> Not alcoholic drinks, just tea. So, Rebecca, go ahead and. Okay, so um, we got two different teas today. We got Ito In, uh, natural unsweetened green tea. And then. Uh, another one, same brand, but it's going to be Japanese green tea, um, also unsweetened. Um, we're trying them chilled, you know, uh, they say that's the best way to drink it. Um, well, it's jasmine green tea, actually. What did I say? Japanese green tea. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. And it's actually a product of, what was it, Taiwan? Yeah, product of Taiwan. It's Japanese number one green tea, though. Sorry. Yeah, so <laughs> number one in Japan, made in Taiwan, though. Or product of Taiwan. Yeah. So real quick on the green tea, Oi Ocha is Japan's number one green tea brand and means tea please. Enjoy the authentic taste of green tea produced by Ito N, Japan's premier green tea purveyor. Brewed from premium whole tea leaves, not tea concentrates or powders, no sugar sweeteners, no added colors. And real simple ingredients, purified water, green tea, and ascorbic acid. That's it. And same ingredients for this. Uh, the only difference is it's with uh, Japanese or the jasmine flowers, um, and they are picked. Uh, the blossoms themselves they're picked at the peak fragrance to uh, make the tea. So, so yeah, we're gonna open these up and give you all uh, our opinions. She drinks more tea than I do. Um, I'm more of a soda kind of person, but uh, I'll still let you know from my side, which is I never drink tea. And then she'll let you know from her side what she thinks who actually drinks a lot of tea. So, let's see. We'll start with yours. The jasmine, the Japanese jasmine green tea. Oh my god, no. <laughs> <laughs> This is what running on a few hours of sleep looks like. <laughs> it really smells like jasmine. That's kind of weird, but well, let's see. It is jasmine green tea, so I would hope it would smell, smell somewhat like jasmine. I don't even know what jasmine smells like, but let's find out. Oh, whoa. Mm. <laughs> mm. That is very fragrant. Like Fragrant. Obviously unsweetened, so zero sweetness. Just the flavor. You don't taste the green tea at all, actually. Um, yeah, the jasmine true. overpowers it big time. Yeah. Um, a lot it's not of bad though. <laughs> I can say that. I, I can definitely drink this. So I am from the south over here in the United States. So my version of tea that I'm usually drinking is southern sweet tea, which is basically mostly sugar and a little bit of tea in there somewhere. Black tea. <laughs> Just a little bit of tea in there. <laughs> a lot of sugar. So this is completely different from what I'm used to. I've, but I've tried all different kinds. So. It is good. I do like it. Um, a little bit of bitterness, since you don't have any type of sweetness in there, you get a little bit of bitterness from, I guess, the tea leaves or something. I could say it definitely would pair well with maybe like a piece of cake or something. Uh, I know traditionally you are supposed to have something sweet with green tea, um, but Ooh, that's know, different. We, we didn't grab anything to to try with it. But let's see how the green tea tastes. Or the I guess just the original green tea, or the Plain. what did it say? Ohi ocha green tea. Different. Very different. I would actually lean more towards the jasmine just because you actually get some kind of floral, something something a little extra. Mm. Mm, no. This one? It reminds me of too much of exactly like the matcha powder. Mm, I've never had matcha powder, but... The matcha green tea, it's, it's extremely bitter. Um, and I mean, you know, this is almost close to the same thing. We're both green tea, uh, but it's not a powder form. Um, but it definitely, it's still very bitter. <laughs> very, bitter. Um, very bitter. Very bitter. 
Though green tea does have its health benefits, uh, I could, you know, that's something it probably would taste a lot better if you had something to eat it with or drink some, some, and eat. Something sweet to kind of counteract the bitterness. But, yeah. That See me? My southern side of me is yeah. like, dear God, put some sugar in there. <laughs> oh, but this one, this one is actually pretty good. I, the jasmine, the jasmine green tea is the one I would personally choose out of the two. Um, I've always wanted to try this one. I've seen it before at a lot of stores. Um, it's actually so big of a brand that you actually kind of start seeing these at regular grocery stores. You don't have to go to a specialty store to find these. Yeah, like uh, we found these at our local grocery store. Uh, usually whenever we get stuff, we usually go to a, a specialty grocery store or we go to uh, one of our favorite places is World Market. They carry a lot of different products, you know, not sponsored or anything. Um, but I, I, I love them. So yeah, it well, gives me a chance to try a lot of World stuff. World Market gives you a chance to actually try some things from other countries and not break the bank with shipping and all kinds of other upcharges and stuff like that. Yeah. So definitely love that place. But in my opinion, of course, this is from somebody who does not drink tea very often, and the tea I do drink in other countries is considered an abomination, a sugar abomination. Oh, yeah. <laughs> um, the Oyocha, no. That's a big pass on me. Uh, if you've wanted to try it forever, I would say go ahead and give it a shot just to try it. I always say that about everything. If you, if you keep seeing something that you want to try, just give it a shot. See what it tastes like. Then, after that, if you don't like it, you'll never buy it again. So this one, big pass for me. Too bitter, way too bitter. Um, but the jasmine, if I did have to drink an unsweetened tea, this would actually be it. It's actually really good. I can definitely say I would try both again. Um, definitely more the jasmine than the unsweetened green tea. Um, Jasmine, I could drink, you know, on a regular day. I don't need anything with it. But if I did do the green tea, I, I need something sweet, like super sweet, mm -hmm. like something I normally can't eat all on its own. Um, but yeah, I I could see drinking both again. Okay, that does it for our review on the E2N green teas, the jasmine and the oyocha. Um, thanks for watching. If you like the video. Please click like for us, subscribe if you want to, and if you made it this far, um, give us some uh, recommendations on things you would want to see on the channel, some things that you would want to see us eat, try, um, pretty much anything. As long as we can order it through Amazon or it doesn't matter, find it as long somewhere. as we can find it somewhere, we will do our best to get it, try it, and give you our opinions on it. Um, for what that's worth. But thanks for watching. And we'll see you later. Bye.